I want to make this very short and very simple. I just want to really send out my love and my prayers to Jesse Smullett. I would like to understand what what makes people act this way, what makes people hurt other people for being who they are and living in their truth. This man ain't did nothing to nobody and he's just living in his truth. I mean, he got called a faggot and a nigga and got bleached on on him, a noose tied around his neck and got a broken rib because somebody hates themselves and somebody is being fueled by a bigot and a racist sitting at the White House right now. This shit is ridiculous. Just see someone that should not have been attacked in that way. This is a hate crime and it should be charged as such. Somebody said a possible hate crime. Where? This man was called a faggot and a nigga. This is a hate crime. This shit is not okay. As a black gay male, I live my life every day waiting on somebody to try me. I live in fear every day, just waiting on the day that somebody's going to find the balls to come at me. I'm scared all the time, every day, because you never know when you're just going to piss somebody off that bad that they want to beat your ass. Black gay men, we have to continue to fight, stay proud, and live proud. Because no matter what, if I get beat up tomorrow, I'm still going to wake up, be gay and black. And I'm going to be okay. And if I die, I'm going to die proud. I'm a proud black gay male living in America. Nobody's going to take that from me. Nobody's going to stop me from being who I am, what I am, and who I am destined to be. Nobody's going to stop me. And nobody's going to stop Jesse Smollett either. That is a beautiful black man who has fought for not only his black community, but his gay community and all those around him. That man is a beautiful black man, talented, incredible, sensitive, understanding, fighting, power, just, y'all gotta stop letting Donald Trump hype y'all asses up. Cause there's gonna come a day where somebody gonna catch you and it's gonna be a wrap. And the same shit you throwing out, is the same shit you are gonna get in return. Stop letting your president put y'all lives in danger. And stop putting our lives in danger. We ain't doing nothing to you but living our best lives. If you did the same, you wouldn't even be worried about people like me. People like Jesse. If you want to make America great again, spread love, not hate. How about that? And the two niggas who did that shit, y'all's a bunch of bitches. Fuck you. Thank y'all for watching. This has been Brainer's Universe. I had to get all this off my chest. I've been holding this in since I've been at work all day. And I can finally let out my real frustrations because I'm sick of this shit. I'm sick of it. Y'all go out here. You love on these babies. You love on these young men and young women who are fighting to just be here. Love on your families, love on your friends. Lift everybody up, pray harder, love harder, and be stronger. We're gonna be all right, y'all. We're gonna be all right. I'll talk to y'all later.